610. You can see the physicals on the left. So with this, you should be able to do everything in the game besides dribble, but there's still some glitchy dribble moves that you can get with 40 ball handling and 40 speed with ball. The normal dribbles, uh, styles and all that uh dribble moves playmaking moves all of them just go normal for most of them unless you want that basic spin uh where you spin out towards three otherwise everything else is normal but for this build you should be able to play defense um stay in front of yours play the pick and roll uh step out um and play the guard if need be for a little bit so you get an 80 close shot and everything is kind of toned to just hit just the bad thresholds so like this you'll lose out on pro touch hall of fame if you don't care about that you can bring it down make the adjustment to however you feel um this is just a template then we got a 61 driving layup just just because um layups if you need to you can go over to big man uh use float game or scooper those are really good um right here we reached uh the threshold of posterizer what we really wanted and then spin cycle is pretty op you get a lot of contact dunks in with spin cycle until they fix precision dunker i found that uh two-step and um Spin cycle has a lot of, lot of contacts. Um, we have 75 exactly, but if you want, you can drop it down to 65 to save some points. I did 75 because I want Giannis dunk package, and you got to have 75 and 75. But if you don't, you can drop that down. And you'll still be able to get the White Howard dunk packages and Ben Simmons, which will be fine. Um. The 85 standing dunk is because you unlock uh, some of the pro contact dunk, big man dunks. Um, not you don't get the elite, but you get the pros. Um, get your fast twitch, rise up silver, unpluckable silver, and this and you can do some back down. It's post control is really cheap to upgrade. Um, you don't have to if you don't want it, but post control literally gives you four to get it all the way up there. Oh, what what changed? Uh, I wasn't at 90, was I? No, I was at 85. But as you can see, it's still cheap to change it. Um. Get you a midi. If you go lower on this, you lose out on midi uh, magician silver. So if you don't want it, you can drop that down. That's the extra batch points there. Um, free throw is just here just because I had extra points. I maxed out the three ball. But if you think you can shoot with a lower three ball, then go ahead and just um, change it. Um, there's no threshold for this. 79 is the threshold, so if you want to drop it, you can. Um, pass accuracy, so you can get uh, some bonus pass style. And who else? You got Nurkic if you like that one. I'm not a fan of none this year, but if you like it, go ahead. And you can drop this down to a 75 or a 77. I like Needle Threader. If you don't like Needle Threader, then drop it down to a 75. Like I said, for this one, you just need the normal dribble uh, playmaking moves. So, and then you can do the basic spin. But that's why I got 40, 43. Uh, interior defense, you should be able to stop most people that's coming in the paint with an 82. Unless it's a pure post score. But even then, if you're in the right position and we got 90 strength for a movable force goal, you should be good as long as... As long as they don't know how to actually do post moves. So, at the center, you're not going to be able to steal the ball that often. But, if they're going to keep throwing it into the post or you plan the pick and roll, bronze interceptor, 
it's not the best, but at least it gives you better animations to try to steal the ball. Uh, this gives you block. I've had silver and I've had gold anchor. I I don't really notice the difference. It if it, it feels the same to me. If you want, you could try to uh, make the adjustments to get it higher. That's up to you. But it feels the same to me. Chase down gold is good. Hall of Fame. I can see the difference in it, but you had to sacrifice. Gold is still good though. You can flip it, but I I'm pretty sure uh you're you're not going to be in position to get the offensive rebound most of the time the other person is going to box out so I go defensive rebound but if you're going to be the person that you think you're going to be more in the paint and able to get the offensive rebound you can switch them that's up to you but hit your 93 on whichever one to get your hall of fame box out Pogo stick rebound chaser um Hall of Fame rebound chaser. I don't see the difference in it between gold. Um, but if you want, you can make your uh, arms longer. It'll drop your three down and try to get Hall of Fame if you want. Um, this is the speed I went with just because I wanted this 90 strength. But if you don't want the 90 strength, you can probably put more speed and you can drop this immovable force down to like um, silver or something. And still keep it. Oh. Um, where would it be at? You can do that, and then you can get your speed or something up. Vertical. If you want, don't want gold chase on artists, you can bring down the vertical to like a 75. But I want chase on artists, that's so. over. And then you stand them with just a bunch of extra points. You just throw them in there. Pretty cheap. And then what we get? Inside out threat. 